Hello, ladies and gentlemen, welcome to another part of Marvel Ziggy Plays The Legend of Zelda Skyward Sword. Last time we left off, we found the Skipper, and we're now we're looking for the uh, Nehru, Nehru's Wisdom, the ship that holds the next sacred flame. Uh, so, this part will be invading this particular pirate ship as well as uh, starting the dungeon itself, which is again one of the more unique dungeons. And I don't remember it being too long, but then again, you never know with me. So let's see how this goes. As we gotta take care. Oh, there are electrical bats now. Lovely. Get off. Get off my face. Oh shit, that's quicksand. Oh, that's actually a smart idea. You can't. You wouldn't even notice that. Okay, let's see. How am I? What? What's our way in here? Also, janky cameras. Janky. Ah. Uh -huh. Well, I'm a dummy, ladies and gentlemen. But we found our way in. It's the simplest of things that you don't, that you take advantage of. But it's okay though. We're in. That's all that matters, and you didn't waste any of your time. So here we are. I wonder how. Aha. Uh -huh. Master, please take a look. Yes, V. That looks like there would be a time stone here. This device looks like it was meant to hold the time shift stone, but there is no one currently installed. There's 95% chance that this is the same type of device as the ones we're encountering in Lenara U Mine. I mean, I would assume so. It's all the same area. Signs indicate that the time shift stones were used in this facility as some kind of power source. So, which means we bring the power source back on, we're going to bring everybody back alive. So, I guess we got a mini dungeon before the dungeon, which is kind of odd pacing. The only thing that I can think of that comes close to this is like um, the optional um, dungeon uh, in the well in Ocarina of Time. And even then, you don't need to do the. Oh boy, here we go. You don't need to complete the entire dungeon to do it. Ow. Oh boy. You need to take your time? No, you're gonna throw fire. And I gotta, we're gonna stop the battle because I got a lizard's tail. I hope that's something new. Do I have a lizard's tail? That's the fourth one I've had. Thanks, game. So pretty much wait till they... Ow. Oh, Jesus, he just hit me with a shoryuken. Oof. Well, that took care of them. So basically, sort of taunt them a little bit and then go for it, I guess? Bombs. Dead. Gotta go across. Gotta go across. Whew. Barely made that shit. Whew. Let's open our way up through here. And so far, nothing. We're, I mean, we're looking. Here's the time shift stone. It looks like we're gonna have to carry it. Master, please take a look. Mm, it's actually encased. It's actually encased. This object is called a time shift orb. I conjectured that unlike the time shift stones we've seen, this device is going to be carried around and installed in different locations. So we can pick this motherfucker up. Give it to me. And we can align. And look how pretty this room. Look how pretty it becomes. I love all the oranges and the reds. Oh, so cool looking. Ow, Jesus. What the? Okay. Get out of my way. Jesus Christ. Why did you give him the electrified? What? Pretty much should just let them attack and then let them get stunned by my shield. Uh, at least once. Also wasted that bottle. Which, that kind of sucks, but whatever. There goes that. Aha! Ah, gee, electrified. 
Poke. And destroyed. There's a chest over there. Don't want to take it all the way. That's actually clever because your inclination is to take it all the way. That's actually pretty clever. I like it. And we got more. Hey, more money. I mean, it is a pirate place after all. Give me the monies. Give me all the monies. I want the monies. Okay. Uh, this is gonna probably. Yeah, it's gonna. Okay. Yeah, I remember this portion. Yeah, the uh, the thing will rise up. Um, and you have to jump according to. Yeah, it's not too bad. Yeah. It's not like a puzzle, it's just pretty much just go, jump. Jumping puzzles, how do they work? Thank goodness Breath of the Wild is going to have an actual jump button. Again, although, most of these other games are not bad when it comes to jumping. Like, it's a little finicky at points, but they usually work. Carrying this orb around to save my life. I wonder if I can roll it. I can. Um, oh, that stays there regardless. Aha. So, do I want to roll it across? Oh, you can't roll it across. I'm assuming we're going to place it right here and then probably pull like a switch down. Because otherwise we can't. Yeah, here we go. As I can put. There we go. Cause that, cause that would make sense. There's gotta be a switch. A Nintendo Switch? Mm hmm. God, that was horrible. Don't pick up after me, kids. Don't. All right. Uh, here's another one. Same thing. Why, why is there uh piranha plants in this place? It's a little weird. Aha! This is what I was thinking of. E. There you go, you're dead. So we gotta find the start of the puzzle. Jesus. Well, I killed it while attacking you, so I guess that works. Okay. Can I not do it from this level? There you go, you're dead. Let's see. I think I have to be up top somewhere to jump down. That's what it feels like. That's what it feels like. Oh, get out of my way, please. Thank you. Yeah, because if we try to go over here, it's surrounded all the way around. So we can't go through that way. It's probably just rupees. Oh, come on. It's Swiping left to right, I think, is the biggest pain to me. Ow, Jesus. Because I think swiping up and down isn't too bad, but left or right is when it gets finicky. There we go. You're done. Looks like we got an, and we got an enemy right there. There we go. Dead. Up and down, up and down, up and down. Oy. Ah, come on. See, like, it feels like it's registering as, like, I'm trying to hit him with the butt end of my... Like, I'm trying to just, like, thump his head, and I'm like, no, I'm trying to slice him in half. Alright, that's an enemy. One at a time. Like, right there. Like... There we go, you're dead. Okay. This part might be a little longer because... There we go. That was pretty satisfying. Come on, kill it. Yeah, I'm just gonna start doing that from now on. That seems so much easier. Okay. Just wait for the stun animation and then, without warning, have to block. You know what you're supposed to do? I don't know. Okay, this is a little... 
Oh, does it not hold that? Interesting. I probably didn't. What? That's weird. Yeah, that does that. No, it doesn't. It doesn't stay. That's really weird. It must be something else then. Ah, okay, I don't. I didn't want to step on it again. Don't make. Oh, there's the block. Wait, what? Oh, let me. Uh, okay, that's annoying. Get this out of the way. I put. I going to get it out of the way. Yeah, it put it in the way. Okay. So then we come. We just basically leave the leave the thing out there, because if we have it in here, it's gonna turn on those electrified fences. There we go, and then we can go the way around. Kill it. There you go. You're dead. And booyah. Not much effort at all. Okay, part of me is thinking. I don't see any skeletons anywhere. Alright, what's in here? Alright, so here comes some trickery, I guess. It's probably gonna be more money. Then you show me more money. This actually might be its own part. Honestly, because I really don't... Because this feels... This might be its own part. It might be a shorter part... But I feel like this should be its own part. It might be the shortest one I do, but I really, considering how long it's already going, really don't want to start the dungeon right away. So, I don't know, maybe I'll release them on the same day like I did with another part, but really feel like this mini dungeon is deserving of its own part. Who knows? Still figuring things out. I'm, that's probably one of the videos, so just let you know. Okay, uh... We have to we have to get that. Where's the where's the time thing though? Oh, I left it out there. What's over here? Can I grab? I'm assuming I can grab it with the with the hook shot. That's kind of dumb. How I can't hook it with the hook shot. That's kind of dumb. Like it's a it's a grabbable surface. All right, let's fight these guys. Ow! And poke in the eye. Register my movements, please. There we go. One more. And poke in the eye. Can you give me something nice? No. Maybe we have to put. Yeah, we have to put the ball. It's basically right here and then go around or maybe not right there but right here there we go and this is based this is kind of a preview to the to the to neighbor's wisdom um, the ship because you'll have to navigate like basically one section will be in one in the past and one section will be future so expanding on further mechanics from the earlier part of the game from the Lenaria money facility, but it's a lot more fun. And I can't explain why. Alright, ow! Jesus! Oh, we need the, we need the I need the fans! Alright, let's get out, let's get out of the safe zone. Because they can't, they won't come over here. Oh look, we only got one too, nice. Alright, one down. And two down. Yay! Alright, pick it up. And drop. I like how it's going backwards. Like, it, it knows, like, no, don't do this to me! Alright, so go ahead and start. Oh, snap. I had a chance to do that. I didn't realize that. I guess I was waiting to turn it around. And stabby stab. Sweet. Alright, that releases that. But we can't have this anywhere near it, because otherwise. Hmm. Or maybe we do. There we go, it just doesn't go away all the way. So now we can place this in here. We basically went full circle. And put it in here. I think that's gonna 
Is it going to broaden the room or is it going to bring the, the ship to life? Pretty sure it's going to bring the ship to life. Oh, look at that. I think we can get that goddess cube now. Hopefully. Oh, that looks pretty fucking cool. There's the pirate ship. So that means we can go in that door right there. Yeah, this is kind of odd to put a mini dungeon, like a full-fledged mini dungeon, before your next big dungeon. That's kind of odd pacing a little bit. A report master. The power of the time shift appears to have caused a change in this structure. I recommend going outside to further assess the situation. Hmm. I, I kind of agree, Fee, but I want to see what's over here first. Unless this is outside. Yeah, this is outside. It, it's out, it, It's all the outside. Unless it's not. Yeah, look at that. It's completely different. We opened something. Hello? Is there anything? Well, there's barrels over here. Let's see if we can get some health real quick. Because Lord knows I need it. Ah! Oh, it's just bugs. I already have those bugs. Yeah, these are the, uh... The ants. I already have. I already have some of these, and that's just taking nuts. We're actually gonna get the bow. The next. The next um, part. So that'll be fun. Is that it? I have information to report, Master. Please take a look. Okay. I see the ship. There is 60% probability that these masts and sails are from the ship that pr that protects Nehru's flame. You can set your dowsing ability to search for the ship that holds neighbors. Oh, perfect. So basically, um, it were th these masks, so that means we can look for it. That that's all there is to it. So let's go ahead and find the ship. As you can see, it's somewhere over there. But I don't know if we're able to douse while we're out. Because I don't... How do I get that goddess cube, though? Like, because there was a goddess cube up there. Like, that's what I want to know. Like, is that obtainable? Look. Oh, hold on. There's something up there. There, I see a hook shot. Let's see if we can get that goddess cube. Lift me up onto on high, baby. Yeah, here we go. Here's the goddess cube. This must be an important one, considering where it's at. Oh, too far away. There we go. Goddess cube away! We haven't got any of the any of them in quite a while. Well, I'll make sure to get some next part, like in our next uh, in between sessions before we go to the final, third and final dungeon. Drafting safe like a pillow, like a pillow, gents. All right, but now we can douse for it. So let's go ahead and save it, because I made the mistake of playing a game earlier today and I didn't save it, and an hour of progress is gone. I'm just like, well, shit. Well, shit. Auto-saving has ruined us, I swear. So it's weird when a game doesn't have auto-saving. Does it have auto-saving? No, it does not. Hey, buddy. So my ship wasn't here either. You found the clue? You know the place? Some kind of thing called dowsing. That's amazing. This time we'll definitely find my ship. Ready to set sail? To sea! Anchors away. A pirate's life for me. You are a pirate. How are we going to search this whole huge sea? I have no choice but to ask you to do it for me, so get cracking. There's a high probability that the ship is currently hidden from review, but if we attack it, then we might catch a glimpse of it. So the sea is the sea, the ship is somewhere over there. You can steer while you're doing this, so don't be afraid to do this. Just keep going this way as we enjoy. I just hate doing it this way. Alright, somewhere this way. Alright, so let's keep going. I wish there was a boost mode on this. This is more like a boat ride, a river ride. Um, but then again, we are in the shallows, so, you know, nothing too spectacular. Yeah, if I, remember, I, remember, I think I remember correctly. It took me quite a while to find the ship, too. We're getting closer, though. Getting... Stay on target. Stay on target. 
Stay on target. And then that guy bails. Was it Porkins? Is it Porkins who bailed? Buy Porkins. That's the new Porkins, by the way. Have to be close. Have to be close. Come on. Be very, very quiet. I'm hunting ships. I ship this. Ship what? I don't, I don't even know what I'm saying anymore. Anything? Hold on. Hold on. Ready to cannon? Notice how it... Notice how it's sort of going in an arch right now. Oh, okay. Motion control. Motion controls. Why? Okay, I thought I had it right there because it was it was just going. Unless I think it's moving. I think it's moving. Come on. I think it might be moving actually. Keep going, work. It's getting weaker. Oh, you can speed it up. All right, it has to be here somewhere. Has to be here somewhere. Come on, where are you? I think this is why I started. Okay. It was right. Oh, I keep. Ah, oh, I keep trying to hit it, cause you gotta hit it with the ship to reveal it, with the cannons. You gotta hit it with the ship with the cannons in order to find it. All right, it's it's out here somewhere. This is this is kind of like it's moving. It's clearly moving. That's why we're not. There we go. We got it. See how it's moving. Did you see it? Whoop, that's my ship. Now how do we stop it? We must pursue and keep pounding it with the cannon. Come on. Where are you? There we go. We gotta get it to slow the fuck. Slow the fuck down! Jack Sparrow, you will not be the end of me. Alright, well, here we are, though. Hopefully there's a save point on the boat. There should be. Usually there's a save point. So we climb our way. Yeah, so this dungeon is on a boat. It's on a boat. I think this is a first. And it's a pretty damn big boat. Like, holy shit. Look at this thing. It's definitely bigger than what Tetra was rocking in Wind Waker. 
I don't see a save point though. That's what I really need. Also, so yeah. Welcome to the sand ship. This is our this and the dungeon has officially started. But we're gonna go ahead and stop the recording right here, ladies and gentlemen. Thank you for watching. Be sure to like, comment, subscribe if you like what you saw. Uh, I'm gonna head back to port so I can do a save, uh, and from there, uh, when we come back next time, and again, you never have to worry about it. Once you hit it once, uh, once you stop it, the the sand ship is always gonna be there. So always keep that in mind. There we go. So I can place a little, and we're gonna go to the save point. We're gonna stop right here. And next, when we come back next time, we're actually going to go on to Nehru's Wisdom. Until then, ladies and gentlemen, I'm the Marvelous Siggy, and I want all of you to stay marvelous. Have a good night, everybody. <laughs>